Pediatric Stroke, Wikipedia Article Audio Pediatric stroke is a stroke that happens in children or adolescents. Stroke affects about 6 in 100,000 children. Stroke is a leading cause of death in children in the U.S. Types of strokes Ischemic Hemorrhagic Symptoms Prognosis Stroke is different in children and newborns than it is in adults. Children have hemorrhagic strokes as often as they have ischemic strokes, while adults are more likely to have ischemic strokes. 60% of pediatric strokes occur in boys. Causes of stroke are also different in children than they are in adults. In an ischemic stroke, blood supply to part of the brain is decreased, leading to dysfunction of the brain tissue in that area. There are four reasons why this might happen. Stroke without an obvious explanation is termed cryptogenic, this constitutes 30 to 40 percent of all ischemic strokes. Intracranial hemorrhage is the accumulation of blood anywhere within the skull vault. A distinction is made between intraaxial hemorrhage and extraaxial hemorrhage. Intraaxial hemorrhage is due to intraparenchymal hemorrhage or intraventricular hemorrhage. The main types of extraaxial hemorrhage are epidural hematoma, subdural hematoma, and subarachnoid hemorrhage. Most of the hemorrhagic stroke syndromes have specific symptoms. Symptoms often include The prognosis for pediatric stroke survivors varies. The following are some common outcomes. Seizures, especially in newborns, keeping one hand in a fist position, especially in infants, worsening or sudden headaches, sudden difficulty speaking, slurring of words or trouble understanding speech, hemiparesis, or a weakness on one side of the body, sudden loss of vision or abnormal eye movements, sudden loss of balance or trouble walking. Cerebral palsy, epilepsy, vision loss, hearing loss.